Hey, my name is Josh. I play in a band called Tokyo Police Club, and these are my five touring tips. Tip number one, pack lighter than you think you should. The first few tours we did, we'd always pack, you know, you're going away for a month, so pack a t-shirt for every other day or something like that. Pack for a week and uh, just don't care that much if you smell. That's always an easier thing than having, you know, all these rolling suitcases and just, you know, packing stuff lightly in a backpack or a duffel bag. It makes your life a whole lot easier and it's a lot less things to forget. I think that the toughest thing to always account for is when it's a tour in uh, winter or fall times when it actually gets really fucking cold and you need to pack the giant coat. You can go two ways. One is pack the giant coat and maybe stash it in the trailer or something like that. That's worked. Or you just get ridiculous and layer six things up and you feel like a marshmallow, but that, that does still work. Tip two, don't try to be a hero and drive that eight hour drive yourself. Split it up. Maybe get two people to drive, better yet get three people to drive. Driving two, two hours to three hours a time, that's where you wanna be. Again, early on, everybody tried to you know, do these long overnight drives themselves. It's just not smart. Save the time, save your energy, save your lives. Tip three, eat healthy. I feel like everybody says this. It's really easy to grab stuff. It's a, you know, on tour, it's easy to just get convenient and eat the gas station hot dog, but you don't want the gas station hot dog. You want a bag of chips and a water, and then you want to try to find a sandwich or something when you get to a place that has decent food. Or you can pre-plan and buy a bag of almonds for the van, or a bag, don't get fruit though, because everybody forgets it and it goes bad in the back and then you're the guy that people are yelling at for bringing the blueberries that you forgot. Almonds, or trail mix. Tip four, expect the unexpected. You can get to a venue on time and things can still go super late and you feel terrible because you're taking time away from the opening band or the support band or you are the opening band and you show up late and that's not professional. So just always plan to add 20% time to any drive uh, your time to load in, all of that. Being early is not bad. You might feel that way when you have to wake up, but that's why you bring your own coffee. This is a sub tip of tip number four. Bring coffee that you can make in your hotel room or in the van as you're going. Gas stations have hot water. You can do an AeroPress or there's cups that have like a French press in it. Those are great too. Um, bring those and that's your morning. Tip five, be friendly. You come into these places and the house crew sees people every single night and it's really easy on tour to get uh, very stuck in your own head and not treat people the way that you should. It makes a huge difference just to come in and appreciate that everybody's doing a job and 99.9% .9 of them are doing a fucking great job. So acknowledging that and actually saying it to those people goes a long way and just yourself having a pleasant attitude coming into something Ultimately, you get to play music for people that want to come out and see you play music, and that's pretty fucking awesome. So never take that for granted and always have a professional attitude.